All right, welcome back to another video. And sorry, I have not uploaded in a little while. Um, with teal season coming around, I've been doing a lot of teal hunting, and I've been working a lot, so I do apologize. But we will get back on schedule now. I got the next couple days off, and I'll have plenty of time to record videos, get ahead, and everything like that. So we're gonna go. Um, we're gonna talk about this new update that's coming out this Tuesday so we're about six days away and with it we are finally getting some new scopes for just like the rifles and everything now unfortunately you do have to pay for the scopes but there is a feature that's coming with this update that's going to be very very nice and one that you do not have to pay for and that is the crosshairs you can start to buy some new crosshairs so like these um a crosshair that's right here. You can buy different ones to make it look better. And right now I think I got the Argus scope. I meant to put on the Hyperion, but I got the Argus on, which is not a problem. But we're getting three new scopes. Two of them I'm really excited for. One of them is still very good, but I just don't use like pistols or shotguns enough for it to really matter as much for me. But the two that I'm very excited for is... I think it's called the Odin, I believe, yeah, Odin, O-D-I-N. That's probably the main one that I'm excited for. It's a 4 to 12 zoom, yep, 4 to 12 zoom rifle scope. So it's not quite as good as the Argus, because the Argus is up to 16. But you can zoom it out, so like, we'll take the Argus right here, for example. This is as far zoomed out as I can go. So if something was like really close, I would not be able to like zoom out that much in order to get onto the uh, the animal that I'm trying to find if it's super close. But what the Ar what the Odin is going to do, which is the new scope, is it's going to let you zoom out pretty far and also zoom in a pretty good distance. So you kind of get like the best of the Hyperion and the best of the Argus, and it's just like combined. So I think that's going to be a very, very good scope. Um, unfortunately, like I said, you do have to pay for that. Um... I kind of was hoping it was just going to come, like, just be like an update, and you wasn't going to have to pay for it, but you do. But, um, we get two other scopes along with this update, and one of them will be the, uh, 3x7 handgun plus shotgun scope. So you can use it on a handgun and a shotgun. And I don't know if I can put pictures up here, because I'm not a partner or I'm not an affiliate with, uh, the Hunter or Expensive Worlds. So, for now, I'm just not going to do that. And we actually hard shot that thing. I guess the 308's too big. I kind of wasn't paying attention. Anyways, um, I don't really want to post pictures or nothing, so I don't think I'm allowed to. I could be, and I could just be completely wrong. But either way, it does seem like it's going to be a very good update. And you can go to their Twitter, or even their YouTube channel, or like Flinter's YouTube channel or something. He's got all the videos about it. And he's like showing it off and everything, but they seem like they're going to be very cool. And I'm very excited for the new like um, crosshairs and stuff that we can get. That is something I'm very excited about. But the second uh, scope that I'm very excited about is the new night vision scope. Because that looks really, really good. It's kind of like pretty much like the other night vision scope, but you get more zoom and you get. Um, what is the other thing? You get more zoom and it looks better. It's not like a bright green that's going to make you go blind. It's like a white, I think they called it white phosphor or something like that. And it looks really, really nice. So that is another one that I'm very excited for. And I think that's one that I'm going to use quite a bit to like go hunting for some coyotes and stuff like that. And speaking of hunting with coyotes, the um, another thing that we're getting with this update, which is also very, very good is the electronic collar that's already in the game which i actually think that i have that anyways the uh it's pretty much getting an update and turning into a fox pro which is like a real company out there and they're they're partnering with them to give them a uh anyways they're partnering partnering with fox pro to get us a new electronic collar all right so we have this little electronic collar right here and i've never even tried to use this thing so let me just set it on the ground here. And you get this little, I don't even know how to use this. Oh. So you get your phone out and it shows like, I guess 
it's map based, so it shows like a turkey call, black bear call, mountain lion call, Rocky Mountain elk, mule deer. So it shows a call for all of them. But we're just going to get an updated version where it's going to be a Fox Pro. And based on what they've shown, it actually looks very, very good. So I'm kind of excited for that. Um, but I'm very excited for this new update. Um, it seems like it's going to be a very, very good one. We're getting all these new scopes and stuff. So we've been needing new scopes for so long. Like, I don't... I'm pretty sure this game's been out for like seven years I think it's been out for a long time I know that but um and we've just had the same rifle scopes the whole time so it's so nice to finally get some new scopes uh, I cannot wait for them to come out and try them out and everything apparently content creators are getting early access to this um, not me though I, I'm not um, a partner yet but there are going to be like videos like obviously Flinter Scarecrow like all the real famous people, they're all going to be getting some, uh, they're all going to be getting early access. And my guess is that it's going to start Friday, if I had to guess, because that's how they normally do it. They normally do it the Friday before the update, is whenever they uh, can start releasing footage, I'm pretty sure. It could be after Friday, though, since it's scopes and not like a brand new map. I'm just not too sure. So, just kind of be on the lookout for that. And, um... We're going to be back to, like I said, I was sorry about, and still am sorry that I haven't uploaded in a little while, but we're going to get back to our normal schedule, trying to post every other day. Now, sometimes I will have to miss one day because of work or something like that, especially now. Uh, there's a shutdown going on where I work, so not having as much time off as I normally do, but um, we're going to be trying to, I, I should still be good to do every other day. I'm going to try my best to do that. If I have to miss out on a day, I do apologize, but I don't want to just make a video that's like super rushed just to get a video out. I'd rather just miss the day and make a better video for the next day. But um, tomorrow um, is whenever I'll start recording my videos. I have another video coming out the day after tomorrow, so Friday. That's going to be a really good video. Um, I haven't recorded it yet, but I already know what I'm going for. And I know it's going to be a pretty good video. We got a lot of mule deer over there. But uh, yeah, I'm very excited for that. For my next video that's going to come out. That'll be Friday. Um, but I guess that's all we got for today. I just wanted to get on here talk about this update. And it's an update that I'm very excited for. And I hope y'all are also excited for it. It's definitely going to be a good one. Even if you don't buy the DLC, you're still going to get the new... Um, the new reticles and crosshairs and everything like that. It's going to be very nice. Um, I've seen a couple of them. I didn't see all of them. I didn't watch the full live stream, but I saw a couple of them. And there's a couple of them that I'm very excited for that I really, really like. And there's just overall a whole bunch of them. So I'm very ready to see what that's going to look like. And we're pretty close. We're only six days away. But yeah, so we're six days away from this update. I hope y'all are excited. Oh, there's a... Um... Alrighty, I had no idea that that was here. That is very strange. What in the world? I gotta figure out what gun I'm gonna use here. All right, I guess we're using the 4570 handgun on them, but we are not taking a shot from here. Okay, this is like so weird. I was not expecting for this to happen at all. But we will try to go and get this guy taken down. This is like actually crazy so we can get zeroed out to 218 I'm a little worried about taking a shot that far we'll see how close we can get off of this point and uh, go from there I really hope this guy makes diamond I don't I think I've shot one diamond mule deer which it's gone now because what happened with my desync but um I got trolled by one not too long ago so hopefully this one will not troll me Hoping this one will actually make diamond, and I, I'm very like shocked that this just happened. I've not hunted uh, Silver Ridge Peaks in so long. I just decided to get on here because it's just a nice little map. So hopefully this guy can make diamond. He's just right there. He's about 160 out. I think we can do that. 
That looks good. He's losing hell. I mean, he looks huge. He's already down. I mean, he looks big. I think... I really hope that makes diamond. He looks absolutely massive. So... I think we got a pretty good chance of him being a diamond. And I guess if he makes diamond, we'll go to the trophy lodge and go throw him in there. And then in the video off there, I wasn't even planning on like really shooting much in this video. I just knew to come to Silver Ridge Peaks because it's pretty easy to find stuff. And there he is. He's down right here. Looks like we got a vital organ shot. We did. So we're good on that. We just gotta hope that he does not troll. Now, unfortunately, I cannot get a good, like, screenshot from here. Wow. I think that's, like, a really big one, but I do not know. And it's a blonde. That thing is... That is huge. I cannot believe that that just happened. 339. That's way above gold. So, or way above diamond, I mean. That thing is huge. I don't think I've ever shot a mule deer that looks like this. That is so like, what in the world? <laughs> Literally just out here to shoot, or just to talk about the update and this guy decides to show up. That is a giant. 339. I will gladly take that. All right, I guess I'll meet y'all at the trophy lodge because I'm definitely going to put him in there right now. Let me just check to make sure there's no other freaking diamonds or anything just hanging around here. That is crazy. I think I like them in here. I like my two diamond whitetail right there, but I think if I get another diamond mule deer, I'm going to change those out. And I got to get some bigger, uh, like, deer shot, like a moose, which I had diamond moose in here. I forgot about that. They also got taken from my decent. I had a max weight and a giant moose that was right here. I used to have a big red deer right there, but it's kind of like I'm just starting fresh. Which I'm not the happiest about. I did have a lot of stuff in here, but as you can see, we're growing. We're getting some more stuff in here. And it's not looking too bad, but we're going to keep him here for now until I get another one. Then I want to change those two out. But this guy just looks massive. He's a really, really big mule deer. And he's a blonde fur top. That might be rare. I've not, I don't play the hunter as much as I used to. I've just kind of been addicted to the angler. I'm sure y'all are able to tell. But very, very nice mule deer right there. And I'm very, very happy about that. So uh, thank you guys for watching. I'll see y'all on Friday going for a diamond African sharp tooth catfish, I believe is what we're going to be going for. It could change. That's my main thing to go for today, though, uh, or for Friday. That's really what I want to go for. But um, thank you guys for watching. And I'll see y'all Friday. And I hope y'all enjoyed the video. And I hope y'all are excited for this update. Um... I know I am. I'm very excited. So I'll see y'all on Friday.